I'm vlogging on my new camera and I'm in Sydney. Like literally every single influencer, YouTuber on the planet says, it's gonna be so hard for me not to look up at that screen, but I'm gonna try. Um, I am so happy to be here in Sydney. You have no idea. I really, really needed this trip and I have been feeling bad lately and now I'm feeling pretty good. I feel like this is the little getaway that I needed and I'm so lucky to be here. I actually um, used some flight credits from some flights that I had to cancel for COVID to come here. And this trip just happened to coincide with um, my beautiful friend Emma's trip. And she's here in Australia all the way from Copenhagen, Denmark, which is just crazy. I've been following her for ages now. She's the kindest soul. And I actually spent yesterday my first day in Sydney um, with her. And I'm going to see her tonight with my friend Maddie for dinner. But yeah, this is the fit today. Yeah, and I'm gonna go take myself for some breakfast now and then I'm gonna go back to the city. I already went there yesterday, but I'm just gonna go for a little solo trip, find some cute things. Guys, Sydney is my home. I freaking love it. Um, every time I come here, I sleep on the floor of my Zia, my auntie's house, and I get the best sleep of my life and it's so nice staying with her and yeah i'm just so happy when i'm here and i'm so happy i'm vlogging on a new camera um let's go get some breakfast <laughs> to be more confident with this in public. Not gonna lie, super nerve wracking. But whatever, I don't live in this city, so it's fine. You're gonna be getting a lot of this angle though, today, and this vlog, sorry. I'm back from shopping in the city and let's do a little haul. I'm excited to show you. First, I went to the Pop Mart vending machine to get a little gift for Nina. Um, but if you don't know what Pop Mart is, it's just a shop that sells these blind boxes, which I'm literally obsessed with. And Nina's been wanting these Hirono ones for literally forever and we've never been able to find them. So me being the best sister I am, I got her both um, series. I cannot wait to give those to her. And then I went into Mui, which if you're from Sydney or Melbourne, this store sells all the Jelly Cats, Miffy plushes, cute things, Sunny Angels that you could ever want. And I got this Sunny Angel. So excited for this. This is the Soul series. They're literally all strawberries. I'm gonna unbox this over on my TikTok. Follow me on there. And I went into General Pants um, to pick up some basics from my favorite brand um, for basics, which is New Denim. And they were having a sale with General Pants. So I got these two tank tops, which are literally amazing. You would have seen me try on the green one. And it has this really nice like ribbed material. And I got this amazing green one, which I just can't wait to wear with my blue jeans. So cute and such good quality. Highly recommend this brand. Everyone always asks where my tank tops are from and they're usually from here. If not, I recommend Jeff Avenue, obviously. Then I went into Sephora and I did not need this purchase, but I got the Fenty Diamond Bomb Highlighter. And I've seen so many people wear this 
on their eyes. Erica Titus on TikTok. She showed me, she didn't show me, she made a TikTok about this highlighter and I was like, yeah, no, that's gorgeous. So let me show you. Like, beauty girl. <laughs> You're not gonna be able to see, but it's literally just glitter. Like I put some on my eyes, just a light wash, and it looks like your eyes are shimmering and it brings just such beautiful attention to your eyes. And I thought that would be so nice for summer and nights out. I'm gonna try it tonight when I get ready to go out to dinner. And then I went to Chinatown and to some cute stores and I got this. I needed a new like towel headband and I got this pom-pom Purin one. So this is for when you wash your hair. I mean, sorry, this is for when you wash your face. Then this is a stupid purchase. I just got this little drawstring pouch for this camera when I'm putting it in my bag just to keep it safe, doesn't get scratched up. It's this little Smiko Grashi pouch. Oh, so cute. Again, if you know me, like one side of me is like, ah, oh, Jeff Avenues, blah, Fenty, Beauty, whatever. And then the other side of me is like, cute things. But I have had such a lovely second day in Sydney. Um, and it's such beautiful weather, literally perfect, perfect weather. And now I'm going to relax a bit and I might go read in the park for a bit. And then we've got to get ready to go to dinner tonight. I'm so excited. Yeah. Okay. Bye. <laughs> Okay guys, I did not realize how little time I had to get ready um, because um, Emma and I are going to get there a little bit earlier to get some photos and I want to get some photos here before I leave as well and I thought I could just quickly take you through my makeup routine. I know I'm backlit but this is the best we can do right now. Um, first off, Charlotte Tilbury, Flawless Filter, then my NARS Sheer Glow. Yeah, I do the same thing literally every day with my makeup and it's not that interesting. I often get people saying that my skin looks nice and glowy when I use this makeup routine. And let me tell you, my skin is anything but that without makeup, so highly recommend these products. Okay, for concealer, I'm going with my Too Faced Born This Way. I've been really enjoying my trip so far, you guys. Like I said before, it just feels so nice to be here. And I think one of the reasons why is because I met Emma yesterday. Hey Emma, if you're watching this. I just think it's so amazing to meet internet friends that you literally only know online, but I don't know, there are some people that you follow online that are your mutuals that you just feel so connected to because they just seem so kind. And Emma was one of those people for me. She always just seemed so kind and so lovely, just such a lovely soul. And I was really like, I really loved her energy, which I'm one of those people that go off people's energies. And she just had such a kind and angelic energy. And when she said that she was coming to Australia from Copenhagen, I was like, go. I hope we can meet up and it just so happened that I had some flight credits and I got to meet her in Sydney because I was going to come here around this time anyway but yeah um, like I mentioned in my TikTok I think it's such a privilege and so rare to make new friends in your mid 20s I'm 24 now and yeah it is so hard for me to make new friends in real life like I feel like I have so many people that I would be really close with on the internet if they lived in my city it's really hard to make your friend to make friends uh, in this day and age. So I really cherish the times when I can spend with new friends and just really get along with someone. It feels so, so lovely. And for my bronzer right now, I'm using this really old L'Oreal infallible um, foundation stick. And I don't think they make this anymore, but it is like the best cream bronzer ever. Um, and it's lasted me so, so, so long. 
And then I'm setting that beautiful bronzer with the Hourglass Ambient Lighting Bronzer Luminous Bronze Light. And blush is Rare Beauty, of course. You only need a tiny amount of this, but I always go overboard. But yeah, I don't have that many other plans while I'm in Sydney. I'm just hanging out. Um, I usually spend the weekends here with my Zia, my auntie. Um, really love spending time with her. Then I really like this Mecca of Judy glass stick just for some like more glow as if I don't have enough already. Brows are done and for eyes I actually go back in with the cream bronzer just get some on my eyes and then like smudge it over my eyelid you can kind of see okay now for the fun part i'm going to use my new fenty highlighter and just like put it on my eyes as a nice little shimmer literally i can't explain it to you but it like melts into the skin so it looks like a shimmery glow like the longer you wear it okay i just finished up with some mascara and now it's time for my beloved charlotte tilbury all-nighter setting spray and this just makes your makeup melt together and become even glowier and it makes it stay okay here's a better look at this glowy makeup you guys i'm so sorry i have like the crinkliest under eyes i hate showing myself up close because of that um i don't know if you can see the eyes off to dinner and you guys will meet emma and maddie as well yay guys i'm actually such an idiot oh my god i can't believe how stupid i am i got here half an hour early such an idiot i don't know what to do now there's no way for me to sit down and I know, Hi how guys. good is it? I'm here with Emma, guys. Hi. And she finally came. Well, I was so early, <laughs> but I was actually late, so. It's all good now, and we're on our way to dinner. Look how cute. We're, we're matching. Because <laughs> Jeff Bellies always match. <laughs> Sorry. Good morning guys. Oh my god, I look a little bit worse for wear today. Um, but I'm wearing my new tank top and I'm so in love with it. Yeah, it's about 10 o'clock in the morning. But I'm just going to the shops now. I'm gonna get some stuff to make a little aperitivo here for me and Zia Lisa tonight. When I say Zia Lisa, that's my Zia is aunt in Italian. Um, so yeah, so I'm gonna get some stuff to make an aperitivo for Zia Lisa when she gets back from work. I thought that would be nice and maybe get some flowers, just something nice for her when she gets back. This is the fit we're working with today, at least before it gets too hot. Um, tank top is from New Shirt Jeff Avenue. Levi's baggy dad jeans, Sambas. I'm just gonna bring this tote bag and my sunnies, which are the specs. I look a bit ridiculous right now. I think I'm gonna go to Harris Farms because they're the best and we don't have them in Adelaide. <laughs>
Okay guys, I'm just getting ready to go to the beach with Emma. We're just going to um, the Murray Rose pool. If you're from Sydney, if you know what that is, I freaking love that pool. It's, it's like a beach pool. Oh my God, did I put on too much blush? And she hasn't been to a beach in Australia yet. So that's really exciting. Um, well, I'm just wearing the same outfit that I wore yesterday, but with some bathers underneath. I don't know if I'm gonna swim um, because I'm just like not feeling too good. I think I'm about to get my period. Let's go bring Emma to her first beautiful Australian beach. I'm so excited. <laughs> Your last day. No. <laughs> Sorry, I didn't want to make you keep sad. It, don't remind me. <laughs> How was your trip to Sydney? It was amazing. Yeah. yeah. To be honest, so much more fun than Melbourne. Mm, Sydney's Mostly the best. Because of the people. Yeah. I wish I wish I was in Melbourne when you were there because that would have been fun too. But yeah. And I loved Sydney. Yeah, Sydney was good. Yeah. And where you tell everyone where you're off to next? I'm going to Uluru. Is that how it's Insane. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. And then Brisbane and then Airy Beach by Whitsunday. Amazing. Yeah. So a whole lot more beaches for me. And everyone go check out Emma's page. Because she's the absolute sweetest. And if you want to have your like Euro um, Scandi girl content, <laughs> this is the best girl for it, honestly. And it was so nice. To meet you. It was so nice so to meet nice. you. Literally had the best time. Yeah. So just surreal. Yeah, yeah. it's crazy. Okay, we're gonna go for another swim. Yeah. Bye guys. <laughs> everybody it is another gorgeous gorgeous day in Sydney and I've just gotten up and ready to go today I'm going to meet Maddie who I was out at dinner with the other night um, in Newtown and we're gonna have a little shopping day I'm so excited yeah it's just another really cool area of Sydney um, that I love to visit and especially for vintage shopping as well I don't know if I mentioned yet but yeah Maddie is the first internet friend that I've ever met up with um, back when I had less than a thousand followers and yeah I really look up to her and Lily Lily's from Melbourne but those are my first two internet friends ever and they're just such such lovely girls so I'm excited to hang out with Maddie today Emma is leaving Sydney today I think she should be like at the airport now she's going to Uluru as she mentioned which is going to be an amazing experience I'm excited for her to do that but yeah just another lovely day get going I'm going to catch the train to Newtown let's go meet up with Maddie <laughs> Going shopping. We're go. We're in Newtown. Yeah, she's bringing. We, why? We're always hanging out in Newtown. I know. This is like where we met as well. Yeah, um, that's true. Actually, I like, forgot. It's the first time we met. Like was in two years ago. Slay. Slay. <laughs> living our best life. Yeah, that's so cute. <laughs> 
up. It looks so cute with your top. Oh Here you go. Give me a taste test. <laughs> How's it taste? Good? so humid in Sydney and that is something that I forgot about this place. Let me show you what I got. I only got one thing that you would have seen in the vlog. We went to Swap which is like a secondhand clothing store but it's like curated. They don't take any fast fashion and it's so beautiful inside and the best thing about it is that the prices are literally insane. I saw this pattern which obviously I'm wearing my breezy shirt right now and I was like what the hell and it's like a shirt material this stunning strapless dress and it just fits me so nicely it has a tie as well um, the top should probably be taken in a little bit and then the only other things I got I got another present for Nina I got her this coaster because we were at this really cute shop and I just wanted to buy something because it was just so adorable. They had all things from different small businesses. I need to go and shower immediately because it's so humid. I'm so sticky. I had such a lovely day today. And Maddie, if you're watching this, it was so, so, so lovely to hang out with you. Okay. Bye guys. because this has maybe been one of the best trips that I've ever had here. This trip has just been exactly what I've needed. I talked about it a lot throughout this video. Um, and the weather was beautiful and yeah, it just felt really great. The week went by really quickly and that's how I know that I had an amazing time. And it's also been one of the hardest times to be here because something happened to Paul while I was away. I found out about it on Saturday morning and I've just been like occupied ever since like my head is just like I can't think straight and whenever I think about it and I think about him I just feel sick um, so I'm excited to get home to see him and look after him he's okay um, he will be okay. Yeah, I'm just in shock a little bit. Uh, for those of you that don't know, Paul is my beautiful, beautiful boyfriend and best friend. And he's the sweetest and kindest person in the world. And yeah, something not so great happened to him. Um, without going into any details, because I don't want to get upset. But yeah, it's time for me to leave. Sorry guys, I just had to come into a different room. There's loud things going on over by the window. Yeah, that's it. I've got to go get my Uber and get to the airport and get home to see 
pole and my cats. Yeah, a really lovely week and sadly not a great end to it, but that's okay. I'm just happy Paul's okay and I'm happy I can be there for him. Okay, I love you guys and thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed my new camera quality. It's been so, so much fun to film on this thing. Like, I'm so excited for the future of my YouTube with this. This is, I'm living out my, you know, 12 year old dream. So, yeah. Love you guys. Speak soon. See you soon. Bye.